morning everyone. Today we will be discussing about biodiversity. So uh, before that, let me just ask you which do you like better? A or B? Okay. How about this one? A or B? How about this one? A or B? 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 A oh, <laughs> wala na. So, biodiversity. When we say biodiversity, uh, bio means what? What is uh, biodiversity? Bi bio. So it's means life. So how about diversity? When we say diversity, it is variety. So uh, combining the two words, biodiversity is the variety of life on Earth. So every living organism is different from the other organisms, right? And the essential interdependence of all living things. So, all of these living things is interdependence to each other. Again, uh, another definition, the variety of life in the world or in a particular habitat or ecosystem. So, basically, when we say biodiversity, is yung different life forms dito sa mundo. Again, when we say variety, the quality or state of being different or diverse. So, variety is being different. So, for example, yung uh, palay. There are uh, abundant variety. I mean, there are different varieties of rice. Diba? May mga dinurato, hasmi, silandome, etc. So, yan yung variety. The quality, of, or the quality or state of being different or diverse. So, let's talk about the three components of biodiversity. First is the diversity of genes. Chihuahua, beagles, and rottweilers are all the same species, but they are not the same because there is a variety in their genes. So, in here, they are uh, uh, called dogs, right? But then, there are different genes. So, in Chihuahua, different genes yan. Beagle, different genes. And also with rat trailers. Another example uh, for you to understand is uh, yung mga monkeys. Di ba? May mga variety of uh, may mga iba-ibang kasing monkey. Ano pa ba? Ano pa ba yung mga example? Yung mga cats. Yung mga pusa. There are variety of uh, cat. Di ba? And then Dito sa dogs, hindi lang chihuahua, beagle, rat wheeler, may mga iba-ibang uh, variety pa of uh, dogs like pitbull, aspin, yan. So that is the diversity of genes. Another one is the diversity of number of species. For example, monkeys, dragonflies, and middle beauties are all different species. So, uh, when we say the number of species is yung monkey na to, this monkey, yung number of monkeys in this area is not the same with the number of mon uh, number of uh, dragonflies in an area. And then yung trees, number of trees is not different I mean, it's not the same with the number of uh, uh, flowers in an area. For example, sa rice field, hindi naman pare-pareho yung number ng palay, ng snails, ng snake. Diba? So, that is what we mean by the diversity of number of species. So, another one is the 
variety of ecosystem. So, uh, in a region or uh, in an area, they have several ecosystems. They always define ecosystem as nandun na yung living things and non-living things. There are different kind of species in an area and uh, kasama na yun yung abiotic or non-living things. So, yan yung ecosystem natin. So, the variety of ecosystem in a region or in an area, there are different kinds of ecosystem. Like, for example, freshwater pa lang, there are a lot of variety of freshwater ecosystem like lakes, ponds, rivers. And so, with marine ecosystem, there are different ecosystem of marine, rocky coast, sand dune, estuary, salt marsh, coral reef, and uh, other marine ecosystem. So, that is the variety of ecosystem. You see, uh, this uh, three components of biodiversity in an ecosystem pa lang, there are different kinds of uh, species. There are variety of species. For example, as a coral reef. So, yung coral reef is an ecosystem. And then, under that ecosystem, there are different kinds of, there are variety of species. And yung mga species na yun, there are variety of genes. So, that is uh, biodiversity. There's the three components of biodiversity. Moving on, let's talk about the importance of biodiversity. First, ecological life support, economic, recreation, cultural, and scientific. Or say, uh, life support, every living thing is like uh, what I said a while ago, every living thing depends on each other or depends on other living things. For example, tayo, di ba? We depend on our biodiversity. We uh, nabubuhay tayo because of uh, the mga resources natin. And that comes from biodiversity. It supports life. And then economic, so, uh, the status of an area also depends on its bi biodiversity. Diba? Uh, like, for example, in Coron Palawan, it is, uh, ano to? Kilala to, not just uh, in the Philippines, but then all over the world. Coron has uh, ang daming biodiversity, ang daming ecosystem, like lakes, beaches, Napa, falls and uh, uh, other ecosystem. So, uh, tourists visits a place or visits Koron because of uh, the diversity. So, it increases the economy. Right? So, how about the creation? So, we enjoy as a human being, we enjoy yung uh, uh, biodiversity natin. We enjoy looking at uh, uh, different kinds of fishes, different kinds of ecosystem. And then cultural, it preserves yung uh, culture. Like for example, in the Philippines, there are certain areas in the Philippines that uh, depends on biodiversity or for example, certain animal for their uh, uh, culture. Like, for example, sa Baguio, we have uh, Panagbunga. So, we celebrate, you know, uh, I mean, flower festival. So, we have a flower festival. So, uh, that flower festival will not, will not continue kung mawawala yung mga varieties of flowers. Kung isa lang, natitirang, kung isa lang yung natitirang variety of flowers, hindi na siya... Uh, parang hindi na siya flower festival kasi flower festival is uh, different kinds of flowers so that is cultural and then scientific of course uh, scientists depends on uh, or study mga herbs and then they create medicine from herbs from our biodiversity cosmetics yan so overall this the importance of biodiversity is laging papunta sa tao. Laging tayo yung nakikinabang. But then, what are we doing? 
we uh, depend our uh, uh, food sa ating uh, surroundings. But then, uh, uh, in return, ano yung ginagawa natin? Yan. So, biodiversity has intrinsic value. Intrinsic values? I mean, intrinsic value, something that has value in and of itself. So, biodiversity, every living things, every life forms has value. We may uh, uh, directly experience it or we, we may directly uh, nararasan man natin yung value niya or hindi. It has value. Yung mga microorganisms, it has value. And of course, syempre, mga human being, we have our value. Next, what do we get from biodiversity? Oxygen. The plants produces oxygen. Food, of course. Clean water. Medicine. Aesthetics. And ideas. So, um, that is what we get from biodiversity. So, it's, it's very important for human being. Because without plants, how can we have an oxygen? Diba? Paano tayo mabuhay kung walang oxygen? Then next, there are threats to biodiversity. Habitat destruction. When, we, when human destroy yung uh, uh, habitat ng mga living organisms. Or not just human, natural event. And pollution. And most of the time, pollution is caused by human being. Species introduction, global climate change, and exploitation. So, the greatest threat, look at this picture. What is the greatest threat of biodiversity, of our surroundings? Human. Yeah, we are the greatest threat. We depend on our natural resources. We depend on our biodiversity. But what we do in return is we destroy them. We exploit them. So I hope that uh, right now, makapag-isip-isip na tayo that we need to uh, prevent or protect yung ating biodiversity. Because there is no other earth. Pwedeng we just pack our bag and then lilipat na tayo sa ibang planeta. Diba? This earth, yung uh, earth na kinalalagyan natin, let's be a good steward on what God had created. So, we'll not be talking about the endangered species right now. We'll be just uh, we will just talk about yung biodiversity natin. The biodiversity. I hope that you understand what uh, does biodiversity really means. So, before we end, let me just ask you once again questions. So, which is more diverse? A or B? A or B? What is which is more diverse? You compare A and B. Which is more diverse? How about this one? Which is more diverse? How about this one? A or B? How about this one? A or B? How about this one? Which has more cultural diversity? Diversity. Okay? A or B? A or B? Which has more biodiversity? And uh, this one. Which has more biodiversity? So, uh, that's all for uh, our topic about biodiversity.
I hope that you learn something and uh, you just uh, hindi lang puro knowledge nakakwar ka ng knowledge but then you apply things na uh, pwedeng mag-prevent or mag uh, protect ng biodiversity so thank you so much for uh, listening and uh, good morning so thank you